Good morning guys, welcome back to another Romanian vlog. We are in finally in the mystical region of Transylvania. We're so excited to be in so excited. So uh, we are currently in the city of Brazov. It's a city to the Dracula's castle. So I think we're gonna get to know a little bit of the city before heading to the Dracula's castle. Yes, I mean, I don't think it'll take much because it seems very small. Uh, it seems very cute though, so let's see. Let's see. So the first very cute thing about Brazov, not only like the houses are like so colorful as you can see and pretty, there's like this mountain and then they have like a Hollywood style sign, sign saying Brazov. Brazov. It's so cute. So we are in the center of all town and I think it's this way that we really met and will be Romania yeah. with this all beautiful building and this amazing uh, square as you can see the town hall and the church Okay, if you come here you really need to take like at least save 20 minutes just to take photos in this square it's so pretty yes, it's like so pretty. you have like a red building yellow pink blue. yellow blue green like I don't and know it's the, just the so roofs cute are so pretty. So in the main square we found these uh, uh, comic books that uh, belong to the fe uh, International Festival of Comic Books about History and you can see many things here But you have to show them Vlad, Vlad is here as you can see and you can see why <laughs> <laughs> ah, Vlad is so cute <laughs> Just uh, in the end of the square we can kind of get a peek of this huge building which is definitely like way taller than any building here in the square and it feels like a very dark church which is weird because the whole uh, square is like pink and blue and green and then you have like the most dark church we've ever seen so I'm very curious so I think we're gonna try to enter and check it out just uh, visited the church and the main modification to the church happened in the 17th century with the great fire there was a fire here in Brasov that threw down almost half of the city and also came to the church so they say that the church is called the black church because the smoke and the dust made the walls a little darker than usually it is so you have to notion that's how it is yep so now that we visit uh, the most parts of the center here in, in Brasov, we are going to the famous brand castle, the Dracula castle. So excited! Yeah, I don't know if excited. you can tell, but so excited. True. Yesterday there was sun and there was rain. Okay, so we just arrived. Bren and to come here we got from uh, Brasov. We went to the Terminal 2 bus station. The bus stop is here and that's already Bren Castle. So let's see. So excited. So we passed from the ticket line here in Bren Castle and now we have a little park here before the castle. We paid for the student uh, price tickets uh, 25 light, that's around 5 euros. And we also pay for visiting the tunnel. It's, it's like 30 meters deep. Meters down, yeah. Deep. Yeah. Then it's, it's an exhibition. Yeah. So we'll but the tunnel is like so expensive. The tunnel is uh, also almost light. like 4 euros. Yeah, it's almost it's the, basically the, the, price, the price of the castle. Cute! Oh god, that's, seriously, like we're so in love. We have to come during Look. fall. It's amazing. It's a little inclined though. But you have an amazing view. So we just entered Brand Castle. Brand Castle was thought to build in the 14th century and it was supposed to be a fortress to defend between the uh, border between Transylvania and Wallachia. And it's the most famous castle here in Transylvania. <laughs> So 
we're gonna enter in like a recent discovered mm -hmm. staircase. Let me try to get. Oh my god! How creepy! <laughs> How creepy is this? Very small too. <laughs> they put it creepier. It's like so straight. This is how I imagine Grand Castle thing. I got this. Yeah. So when the historical meets fictional starts in the end of the 19th century, when uh, uh, the writer Bram Stoker writes a novel called Count Dracula and became like worldwide famous. The main character, Count Dracula, was mostly inspired from Vlad the Third and all of his fictional myths. So it's kind of a partially history, mostly fiction, and that's where Bram Castle comes to. And on the novel, you describe uh, a few aspects of the castle where Dracula lives, and since uh, Bram Castle is the one who feels more close to that description, now it became known forever as the Dracula's castle, even though in real life Vlad, don't, I don't think it was ever his residence here, he used during his reign a brain castle as a fortress, and uh, they say that maybe it was uh, here temporarily during an Ottoman attack, but it was definitely not his residence. But yeah, until today, like they can shake the reputation, and I think they're owning it they because are, like all the castle is the whole Dracula Vlad um, Halloween inspiration. So yeah, I think they just give up we'll and give in to the to the <laughs> mystical. Now we'll enter the rooms with the mythology associated with Romania. We'll see werewolves and yeah. many different Basically things. Yeah. yeah, so let's go. And there are like noises in every room, so it's yeah, very creepy. So this is Vlad Impeller movie costume, so it's not a real costume, but yeah, it's very nice. Very nice. Yeah, with the, uh, the famous movie. But this balcony is so cute. Yeah, Okay, so I think now we're gonna go to the uh, lift to go yeah. to the tunnel. Let's go. Is he here? Yeah, here he is. Okay, so it's 31 meters down. I'm scared. So the lift. Oh shit. This is the way the slave flies. <laughs> already existed here uh, a few centuries back, but they were slightly renovated. I think uh, it was ordered by Queen Maria, and now they are full of like basically the sounds and technology, uh, counting the story of the castle. I think. So let's see. Oh, okay. Say hi. hi. The tunnel uh, left us here in the downside. And that's a castle right there so yes. you can see how much we went down castle is very interesting and everything yeah. was explained was was good and we really like it i think it was fun yeah, yeah. It was fun. I, I don't think the tunnel is worth it the tunnel is not worth i mean it. it's basically the same price as the ticket it's almost, and like yeah. the tunnel was, it was just like that part the down was the down part was good because the elevator was yeah nice, the elevator yeah. was nice but, but then th there's nothing there no there's nothing, nothing like explain yeah that, that wasn't very nice we're hoping that uh, but like the castle, yeah, the castle is totally worth it. it if really you're is. in the area, you totally have to check it out. A bigger scale 